The Vice President, Dr. Mohamed Baumia, has directed the Passport Office to establish online passport application centers in all the regional capitals of the country to lessen the burden of the National Office in Accra. In one of his surprise visits, this time to the Greater Accra Regional Passport Office in Accra, the Vice President expressed dismay about the frustration applicants go through to acquire a passport. The process of acquiring a Ghanaian passport looks not uncomplicated on the surface. One needs to purchase a passport application form from an approved point of sale, fill the form and submit it together with relevant documents at the passport application center. The applicant is then invited to take a digital photograph and biometric data fingerprint and then the applicant receives a submission receipt which contains a passport collection date. Depending on the type of form that an applicant purchases, it takes about one or two weeks for one to receive the passport. However, the reality in acquiring a Ghanaian passport is far from what is stated above. These individuals have been chasing their passport for months, but to no avail. I applied about a month ago, but when I come two weeks, when I come two weeks, so I think the system needs to be changed. I'm frustrated because I've been here since last year, March. I was, I was here a month later. They say I should go and come, I should go and come. I was here last month, they said they, they, say they can't find it. And I, I'm here, I've left my work to be here. And they, still they can't find it. They don't say anything to me now. So I don't know what to do. I don't know how, when I'm going to get, get it. When it comes, the judge refer to always time, come to always time, come to always time. I don't understand. I want to see change. So that if, when a prior express you must get it to always time. The question date, you must get it. This prompted the Vice President Dr. Mohamed Bamiyan to visit the Greater Accra office to verify the situation for himself. He first visited the manual processing unit of the passport office and interacted with the workers and the Deputy Director of Passports at Accra Regional Office Samuel Ofusu Boating. Mr. Ofusu Boating said the centralized nature of the process put a lot of pressure on the staff and this needs to be given a second look. Now when you go online, the next available date that you can get to pick an appointment is 17th when I check this morning. It means there are a lot of people that have applied and uh, they booked appointments. So the next available date is on the 7th of April. But if we are able, because we are doing 150 now, but if we are able to increase double the number to 300, we will open up space so that when somebody comes, you can then have time. And then if we roll up the other centers, because now this is the only center that we do online. So everybody is coming here, those who are doing online. But if we are able to roll out to the other centers, then somebody in Kumasi doesn't have to come to Accra. The Vice President, Dr. Mahabud Mabia, expressed concern about the role of intermediaries or Goro boys in procuring passports. The Goro boys can only be effective if they have collaboration inside. If uh, given to stand warnings, if an, an, an officer is found assisting anybody, Immediately, I report, last, about two weeks ago, an incident happened. I made a report to the director. The officer was quickly withdrawn and is going to face disciplinary action in the ministry. So it is something that the director, in fact, when the minister came, one of the things she spoke about was that if any officer is found assisting anybody outside to do Goro, the person is immediately withdrawn and then the person is made to face disciplinary actions in the ministry. Dr. Baumia directed the passport office to decentralize its online application to make the process easy and flexible. What I'm seeing suggests that we need a lot of improvement here. Uh, people are waiting for since 2 a.m. last night just to submit a form and all of that. Um, and so we need to improve the system. Um, I've talked to the boss here and it's very clear that we need to move from the manual processing to an online processing of passports. And we also need to make sure that every region has that capability to do the online processing, every region. And so this is what, so that we, we abandon the manual, move to online, and you can then have much quicker delivery of passports across the country. Uh, people are suffering too much just to get a passport. Dr. Baumia also promised the passport office of the government's readiness to assist it to meet the demands of the public on time and in an effective and efficient way.